Oh, so nice. I bet the pool water is still a little cold given how things have been, but temperatures in the 70s here this evening. Beautiful blue skies should be a good sunset tonight as these upper level clouds continue filtering on in southeast winds currently out of our Sherman Chevrolet Cadillac Tower Cam. We got all the way up to 77 today in Sherman. That would tie a record from 2015 if this preliminary high stands when they do quality control later on tonight, but most of us have also been in the 70s there into Oklahoma, Sherman and Denison, a little bit more of the outlier with some of those temperatures. But going forwards, we're also going to see 70s again for Thursday, but more clouds on the way tomorrow, mainly some upper level clouds filtering in during the afternoon, during the evening, and then we'll continue to see the cloud cover heading into the weekend. We'll start off about 47 degrees Thursday, south wind 5 to 15, partly cloudy skies. If you are hoping to take another venture to the lake either this evening or tomorrow, Here's those updated lake levels. Texoma is up about a foot thanks to the rain from last week, and that runoff has also helped some of our southeastern Oklahoma lakes. We have more rain coming, which is good given all the red on this map, but unfortunately it times out with your weekend plans because of this upper level low. That's going to be swinging on through Friday night into Saturday. Could give us some thunderstorms there for the overnight, but this high pressure here is important. Even though it's way far north of us, that's going to keep this low pressure staying south and continuing that southeast track, bringing storms all across the southeast, heading into Sunday and even Monday of next week. We'll have calm skies by Monday and Tuesday, but until then, storms possible Friday night into Saturday. I am anticipating this low and severe weather risk to be brought farther off to the north and the northeast there into Friday night and Saturday morning. For now, storms start out in the afternoon out west, then they'll move in by the evening. Spotty initially before more widespread coverage arrives after about 11 o'clock Friday night, and we'll see these thunderstorms across southern Oklahoma and north Texas through the early morning hours on Saturday, wraparound showers possible Saturday into Sunday, and then all of this clearing by about Monday of next week. So look at the next seven days sponsored by Kane and Roofing and Construction. We are going to see those temperatures continuing to stay in the 60s and 70s for the next two days and then into early next week, upper 50s Monday and Tuesday lows going to be in the 30s and 40s and then back in the 60s next Wednesday. Guys.